I have never really fished in Rust, and I figured it would be an extremely relaxing way of enjoying the game without the stress of the harsh, wasteland survival Rust usually offers. Little did I know how incredibly overpowered this strategy was, and how rich you could become off of it. Hey! Welcome everybody. Today I'm playing a very different server. It's a bit of a smaller map than what I usually play, but I'm going to be living by the ocean and I'm very excited for this wipe. I'm not going to lie. I kind of want to be living near a fishing village as well, but I'm not too sure where. Because I'm going to be attempting to make a fisherman's hut. <laughs> I don't know how it's going to go. I'm excited. Hopefully it's nice and chill. And for those of you that don't know, you can actually sell fish on this game for scrap. So it's sort of like a unlimited scrap kind of situation. With an idea of where I wanted to build, I wasted no time in heading to my desired location. Awesome. Awesome kill. Ooh. Appreciate it, brother. Yeah, some tools. I wonder if the fishing villagers have any recyclers. Oh, they do. Yo. That's huge. Oh, awesome. I don't actually have any BPs at all on this server, so having a recycler here is actually going to be kind of useful. Oh, this guy's bugging. Why is he bugging, bro? This guy's bugging out. <laughs> what is... <laughs> Yo. <laughs> See, I can build right here. This should be good. Hey, I didn't actually want to build an adobe, but it's fine. We've done it now. Hey, base down. I guess the next plan of action is to hunt for some animals. And of course, get enough cloth for a bag. That would be, uh, <laughs> that'd be handy. Perfect start. Yo! Right, that's given us enough low grade to make a furnace. Let's get our metal on. Well, the metal we have. Let's head over here and do our little quest. Begin getting our fishing rod and Catching some fishies, selling them for scrap. I'm looking for work. I need a fishing rod. Oh, that was loud. God damn. That's not too far away. <laughs> hey, here it is. Okay, let's see how this works. Keep in mind that this was my first ever time fishing in this game, despite having thousands and thousands of hours played. So I was kind of learning as I went. Small trout. Ten. Wait, is that good? Should I gut that? Oh god, the pressure's on. Hold up. What did I get? Small trout. Oh, so they're not actually that good, so I should probably put it on the line. Because it's higher bait, right? Yeah. I think that's how that works. And after a small fishing session, I learned how it works, so it really is something everyone can do for some very easy scrap. I then continued roaming around my area. Oh, there's a guy here with a bow, I think. I think he has a bow. Yeah. I missed. Did I get him? Yeah, I did. Awesome. Yeah. Not bad. Mm. 
Right now, this was an absolutely flawless start, and there were still plenty of players running around in the wilderness, so I took advantage of that. He jumped with my arrow. Whoa! Holy! That's what I'm talking about. Oh, there's a base there. Okay. A little rock base. Well, to be honest, I think I'm just going to keep roaming around. If I keep getting kills on people that are just starting out, then that is going to be pretty epic. Oh my god, that just is terrifying. Oh, a med stick. That's such a good BP. Oh, now hatchet. Oh, I need, I need that. Awesome. Dude, that's two sick BPs. Metal Hatchet and uh, Medstick. I was running out of space in my base, so again, I needed to expand and organize some of my boxes. go if any of you are wondering what sort of base this is it will be linked down below it's just like a cool little roleplay base i don't know it's gonna look really nice i'm gonna add some extra stuff to it as well awesome not too bad we can also um move our bag just here and it'll actually act as like a ramp so because i have the small box here if i just crouch it'll just let me go all the way up obviously <laughs> i don't want to get burned but yeah i can just go up here without making a noise only being about 45 minutes into wipe i gathered 60 scrap and purchased a diving tank and flippers allowing me to begin the pump quest which would prove to become super useful in the early game dude there's a guy here wait i won't die for fishing village well i don't think i will <laughs> Mischievous. Let's get him. Oh. Just killed himself. There's another guy over here. The waters are populated. You get some decent stuff though, to be honest. Like 16 high quality. That's actually awesome. Oh, huge. That's huge. Oh. Oh no. He might have a pump. I might die. I'm scared. Oh, he's going. Get my crates. Oh! Oh! oh. I'm gonna die. No. The waters were very populated and the dive sites were limited, so unfortunately I couldn't get the pump just yet. However, I did get a bunch of components that I was able to recycle. 200 scrap. Awesome. And with that scrap, I was able to buy myself a boat, making farming much, much easier. Wait, is that... That's a dead body. <laughs> Wait. And there's one over here too. I think. Yo. Okay. Thank you guys. Hey, I did it. May as well get the rest though. Ooh, a suppressor. Damn. It was really nice and peaceful out in the ocean at the minute, so I used this time to do a little fishing. Ooh. Oh! 
Yo, that's huge. Small shark. I know that's good. I know that's good. Oh, yes. Man, look at this. Just chilling. Sunset. I'm stupid. <laughs> Already having one small shark meant I was one away from 90 scrap, as that's what two of these things sell for at the fishing village. I had only been fishing for a total of about 5 minutes so far this wipe, and things were already proven to be quite successful on the ocean front. There we go. Can we fill these? And I'm going to grab myself a crossbow too. Yeah. It's already like kind of roleplay. And I like it. <laughs> Hey, got the pump. <laughs> I detach it, go. And I want it. I really don't like the fact that my boat is here, but I mean, if someone takes it, sure. No, that horse would have been huge. Please, Kimmy. How's that not a headshot? Let out, oh. Just want metal and there isn't actually too much. Not that I'm seeing anyway. No! Dude. That'd have been an elite kill. Yeah, I'm gonna do some upgrading now, and you know what? I am really tempted to leave it wood because I want that role play look, bro. I really do. And I think I'm gonna leave it wood. <laughs> a cute base with a Chad living in it. <laughs> jump scare, jump scare incoming. Oh no. <laughs> oh, nice. Jump scare. <laughs> Yo. He had Oxum's loot. Nice. This pump should be illegal early wipe, dude. It, should, it really should. Oh my goodness, I need some box space, bro. Oh, <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh my god, can't get a single fish. Ain't no way. Oh, what is going I can't get a single fish. Oh my god. <laughs> Yay, sardine, let's go. Give me something. Yes, yo, 90 scrap. Very successful. Yeah. Hell yeah, dude. That's what I'm talking about right there. Let's go. If I remember correctly, I have a, yep. I have a pretty role play item that I can be uh, utilizing here. Hold up. No, not quite. Oh, I was gonna say that would have been insane. Oh, 
Oh, okay, it still works. That would have been crazy. <laughs> I heard some revolver shots at Oxum's, and this was the perfect chance to get my first ranged weapon of the wipe. Oh, he's over here. Oh no, I think the... I think he got him. This guy got the Revy guy. No. Oh, I don't know where he went. Oh no. That could have been such a good opportunity. Rip. Unsuccessful this time, but our chance would come. I just had to be patient. Tank top gaming. Uh... Okay. Oh my, dude, this is insane. <laughs> this is actually insane. <laughs> this is silly. This is ridiculous. <laughs> the only sad thing is, I'm out of buckshot nearly. And I will be after this kill. That rock base I noticed earlier still had a wooden door, so with my pump, I crafted some handmade shells and went to see what was behind it. I, I really just can't see. Oh, it is open. He has a boxer. Yo! Yo! 50 sulfur. Food raid. Nothing too crazy, but it was one less person in the area that I had to worry about. One tag, one tag. Two tags. Hey, that's a kill. <laughs> yes, sir. Well, I'm going to add the roof, actually. I'm going to do that real quick. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Cute roleplay base. Aw. Hey. <laughs> this is adorable. <laughs> and with the porch as well. Oh, it's actually going to look nice, man. With the boathouse too. The little fishing dock. This is going to be a beautiful little base. I'm gonna do the porch as well. Oh, I can't help myself, this looks awesome. Oh no, can I not do steps? What you doing boy? What are you doing? Oh man, what if I do a low foundation? Did that work? Yes. <laughs> this is cute as fuck. Hey, small shark. Let's go. Yes. 90 scrap. I think that gives me a bit of scrap as well. Yeah, this is actually kind of OP. It's fun as well, I'm not gonna lie. It's quite fun. Hey, let's trade in this bad boy for a bit of scrap. Dude, yeah, 55. That's just an easy 140 scrap. I was sat there for 10 minutes. This is, this is meta. This is meta. Considering I don't have BEPs, this is uh, really quite good. Like I said, I was gone for 10 minutes, and in that time frame, somebody had built this right above my base, so I needed to check it out. 
Hey yo, when did this get built? I only just noticed. What the hell? Oh, what? He had a pump as well. Oh, he had a water pipe. He actually, no way. Unfortunately, now I was pumpless, but not to worry, as I crafted the legendary crossbow and nail gun and headed back to the Oxum's area, as this is where I'd been getting a lot of action. Hey, what is this? Yo. Salvage iceberg. What the? Oh! That was bot. Oh, that scared me though. Damn. I was about to buy another boat, but this time I didn't want to get it stolen. So I built a little boathouse connected to my base. This should work fine, I don't see why it wouldn't. Hey, you know what? It actually looks okay. Yo, look at this thing. <laughs> so cool, so goofy. And with the boat I had purchased, I travelled to a snowy island to get some nodes, as they were really hard to come by in my area. What is that? Is that a small box? Wait, what the heck is this? What the... I've never seen that in my life. <laughs> Decent farm run though, definitely needed. There we go, got all the furnies going. Much, much needed. And you know what? I am just going to craft a tier 2. I may as well just have it, even if I don't need it just yet. <laughs> this gamer, look at this gamer. I want to kill him low key. Oh. Let's go, let's go. Dude, what? Let's go! Oh. I now had a weapon I could research, however, whilst I was out fishing, a big fight broke out outside a fishing village, and I heard the sentry turrets go off. Oh, oh, wait, no way. No freaking, no way. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. 180 scrap, dude. This is OP. How have I not done this before, man? And just like that, I had managed to get myself a saw, 200 scrap from fishing, and enough to tech tree down to the garage door. This swipe was going incredible. Not sure why, but part of me really wants to low wall here. And I, I, I don't really know why. I'm not going to do it here, obviously, because gonna be going out for the for the fishing dock but you know something was just screaming at me looks better get these garage doors down researching the semi and the med syringe I was able to roam around with a bit more security I feel like this guy has so much farm dude I just have a feeling oh Oh, now I've got to try and scale all the way back up this mountain. Oh.
Not long after this, I noticed a lock crate had come out of train yard, so I headed over in a direction to see if I could make anything happen. Oh, train yard has lock crate. I could go in that direction actually. Have a look around. Oh no, maybe not. He had coffee can. I wasn't going to kill him, but he could have a gun for me. MP. Oh, nice. Okay, classic bow fight. HMLMG I saw. Hmm. Uh. Ah, <laughs> don't. That made my heart drop. With a successful Chinook crate, I made it home safely and then decided to begin the fishing dock I had planned for this base. Okay. Can you jump up here? I really hope you can't. No, you can you? Not really. Okay. And we're going to have a door here as well. So basically, if I do end up dying while fishing, then it wouldn't really be too much of a problem because no one can really loot me unless I have a ladder. And for some reason, this fishing dock brought a lot of unwanted attention, which you'll soon see later on. For now though, I continue doing some base work to make this little roleplay house a bit more secure. Dude, this is actually lovely. Hold up. Prison cell gate. I, I kind of want that, dude. Oh, what? <laughs> Dude. That would have been legendary. Yeah, this is what I mean. I can just section it off like this. Oh, wait. Actually, no, that's uh, not really a problem. Nah, I don't mind that. It's a bit awkward, but I don't mind that. I think what I meant to get was, yeah, chain link fence gate, but it's so much more scrap. That works fine. Sorry, Alex, but you're doing that right outside my base. I can't resist. Yeah, <laughs> I should be able to fish here. I think I will be able to. <laughs> so role play. Well, I feel like it would definitely be rude not to not to use my little fishing dock. Hey, first catch at base. Sardine. The first two minutes of me fishing already saw me have my first visitor. I'm still not sure why, but people were very intrigued by my base. Definitely has an eoka or something, I could just tell. Get out of my, get out of my base, bro. I don't want you here. I'm gonna make him think I'm a noob. Why is he not killing? Dude. Why is it not killing? What the hell? <laughs> Salmon, hey. I don't know why, but this is reminding me of, of Minecraft and I'm loving it, dude. I'm actually loving it. <laughs> this is so good, so peaceful. Yes, let's go, small shark. I already have one at base and I have a salmon as well. So that's already, I've been sat here for five minutes. I've already got 150 scrap. <laughs> it's so fun. Oh, 
God, how bad? How bad? Even bought a building plan. <laughs> Maybe I won't be fishing in peace. <laughs> I'll take this all though. Thanks. That's not even a si It's just some random guy. <laughs> Dude, leave me alone. I'm just trying to fish. I thought this was going to be peaceful. Well, clearly not. <laughs> Like, what? What is your problem, Elton? Whoever you are. I think I need to sort this out. So, I'm going to go trade in my shark, learn metal barricade, and then farm for some metal blades. Because this is doing my head in. I just want to farm in peace, man. <laughs> gimme, gimme. Three twenty scrap, thank you. Oh, huge shotgun trap. Actually, really nice. Oh, salvage ice pick. Okay, I think that's all of the metal blades we need. I don't like there. I guess. Yeah, that'd be fine. I grabbed my green card that I had got right at the start of the wipe, and the only monument that supplied blue card was all the way across the other side of the map. Please be loaded, please be loaded. Ooh, not bad. Not bad. Not gonna depot it, but I'll take it. I'm gonna use your bridge, sir. Hopefully, you don't get mad at me. Oh no. Oh, and it didn't respawn yet. Damn. The card run was complete, but I had come too far to turn back, so I stuck around until it respawned. Luckily for me, I had something to do, as I heard a raid in a distance. Oh. While I wait, I guess I can attempt to counter this. Yep, he's in there still. I didn't think he would... Oh, no. I didn't think he would push out. Well, that sucks. That kind of sucked, but at least I had a bag and a stash with the green card. At least we still have our stash wherever it is. Hello? With my newly acquired blue card, I headed to train yard to do the puzzle to get a red card. Hey, it's up. Nice. So many milk crates. Ooh. I'm alright, yep. What a loser, man. This guy is such a... Such a rat. Such a rat. Just for context, this guy was camping me and trying to sabotage my little fishing missions, hence I called him a rat. <laughs> oh, my God. Why do you have so much? Oh my god.
My area was quite grubby at the minute, so I grabbed myself a pump and cleaned up the players that remained in the area. Oh. Oh shit. What the heck is going on, bro? And because of my area being grubby, I made myself roof access to prevent from being door camped. It needs to be done for my own safety. Okay, ready to go. Yo, any loot? Oh, damn. What the? Okay, perfect. Hopefully this is enough to honeycomb a decent part of the base. Oh my god, worst spray ever. Jeez, man. What the heck? Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, take two. Let's, uh, let's pray. I'm not getting sabotaged. Or I won't get sabotaged. Okay, we're good. Get back inside before some crazy person comes. Ugh. With the cards I'd spent all day getting, I headed to rig with my LMG and full coffee can kit. But things didn't go as expected. Dude, I'm half HP already. This is bad. This is bad. I'm just throwing away an LMG. Screw it. It's what it is. Yeah, well, just what a terrible play. That was just terrible. Oh my god. However, upon respawning, I noticed that Train Yard had Chinook Crate again, so it wasn't all bad. Oh, it's gone. Shit. Oh my god. Is that him? No. Dude, hello? I, like, I just can't see. I need flash, man. I think I would add. Um, that was a shocking crate. So it was pump spaz. No, it was spaz garage door, SMG body. I don't know. I don't know what it was, but it was rubbish.
That's all I know. <laughs> he was here in barrels, man. I can't, can't avoid that. I can't not kill him. Apologies. <laughs> Despite dying at oil rig, at least I got the Chinook crate. I then went on a little recycle run at the fishing village. Okay, well, I'm gonna go trade in my shark and then uh, buy another boat. Finally! Okay, I really want to set up some electricals, electric furnaces especially, because farming wood is getting on my nerves. And I don't want to do it anymore. I probably have nowhere near enough scrap, because for some reason it costs an arm and a leg just to learn simple electrical items or components. So I'll need the battery, 75. 400 just to get the furnace, dude. That would do. Just needed a little bit more upkeep and... Wait, 900 sulfur ore for an electric furnace. Hold up. That's, dude, that's, I'm doing that. <laughs> no questions asked. I'm pretty sure I have, like, 900 sulfur ore as well. Oh my god, did he headshot me? What a shot! Holy shit, dude. He headshot me on the turn. That's crazy. Awesome. Let's go. With the electrical furnace blueprint, I can now smelt ores without having to farm wood, which is amazing for solos. Just because these these roofs aren't honeycombed. This one is though. Yeah, I think that's as best I'm gonna get it. Yeah, that's not too bad. Get these on the wall. And I think three should nicely fit in here. I'm hoping. Huge. <laughs> Let's go. There we go. <laughs> Sir, can finally mass produce metal. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, they look horror. Oh, 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 oh. oh. No. no, 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 no. I think they'll look good. Like, I think they'll look really nice on Adobe textures, but no. I don't rate them in that. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, nice. That's a nice door. I like that. <laughs> I mean, Adobe. Leave it. I've had that there since since day one. Now it's just gone. Yeah, another locked crate came out. So I headed over and managed to get onto the top of the roof yet again. Damn, dude.
We going for it. We going for it. I don't even care. Okay. GG, dude. GG. Holy shit, that's a play, though. Fair play, brother. No way. That's actually a play. I went over to oil rig and cleared it in hopes of counters, but unfortunately nobody came. And luckily enough, cargo also just came out. So that's where I headed. Cheeky, cheeky bolt AX. Yeah, don't know if I'll use it, but I'll for sure take it. That is terrible. Ugh. Oh, hello. No way. Well, got a boy on board. Oh no, this is not good. And the last crate just opened. Are you kidding? Oh my, I'm bricked. Oh, I'm so bricked, man. I'm so bricked. Get up, please, get up, please. I didn't even see him, dude. GG, bro, GG. Uh. After this death, I decided to call it there for the night, and when I got back on the next morning, the server was pretty much dead. But I enjoyed this wipe, doing something that I rarely do and definitely making some great profits. Overall, a really chill wipe. As always, thank you so 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 much to the channel members, and I'll catch you next week for another Rust Adventure.